For many, watching porn is a very private matter, but one man is going public with his lack of satisfaction. A deaf man is suing Pornhub and a few other pornographic websites because he says he cannot enjoy video content without closed captioning. <laughs> so what would that closed captioning I look mean, when like? You, when you think about Ooh. it. Ooh. Ah. Uh. Yes. Well, well but, yes. No, how, but how about the other sounds? More. I mean, it's like closed captioning. You're watching... A Western and the horses, it says, horses neighing. <laughs> I mean, can you imagine the the moaning, the groaning, the and screaming? Then the, yeah, and then the other noises, like bed banging, bang, 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 bang. <laughs> and, and I mean, I feel, the, I feel the guy's pain. I mean, that's the best well, part. Well, so of apparently me. he's suing under the American with Disabilities Act, which was introduced in 1990 and meant to actually prevent discrimination on the, on the basis of disabilities. Uh, apparently, he's not only suing this particular Pornhub website, but also the YouTube version. I guess it's called you. It's called you porn. Uh, you porn. And, oh, quit um, acting and like you too. don't know what it is, Dr. <laughs> Batra. Oh, that yeah. you. Oh, is that right you on the, oh, yes, that one. <laughs> No, it's interesting. I mean, there's there's a real question here, right? Because there has been a proliferation of these lawsuits that are using this law that was meant to prevent real discrimination and then just targeting different businesses. Yeah, so, I'm not sure very, that very this was the spirit of the Disabilities Act. Yes. Well, let's when let's they, bring in an expert they, providing they, some uh, legal insight today, Attorney Jennifer Lisa Dubler. Welcome back. Thank you. Welcome. Welcome. Thank you. So, in your legal opinion, is Pornhub and these other sites, are they in violation of the American with Disabilities Act? No, they are not. So the issue here is if the content is available on television and the internet, then it is required to have this closed captioning. But something like Pornhub that's only available on the internet is not currently required to have this closed captioning. And that makes sense. You think about how many websites there are out there. If they were all required to have this closed captioning, it would be just completely... Burdensome. Are pornographic movies required to have closed captioning? So if they were on television, then so yes. So actual, actual so television. So broadcast or cable television. So if it's on the web or theoretically if I go get a DVD, if I were to go get a DVD. <laughs> <laughs> so when you go well, get that, a DVD. It's, it is funny because when I read this, my first thought was this is ridiculous. Honestly, I, I appreciate the idea behind championing more closed captioning, dude, but I, the, what what is dude, what does that look dude, like? Dude, the sound yes. effects are everything. What are you talking about? <laughs> no. Especially the but, music, but, right? But, but, but Jennifer, I mean, it sounds so cut and dry. I mean, you spelled it out. You just said, well, if it's it's internet based, then you have no requirement to to include closed captioning. So why why is this person? Suing. There's so what you're there. seeing happening exactly. So what you're seeing happening to... so much yeah. more. You would, you would have to change the laws the, first. Right. So. The cost of litigation is so expensive that a lot of times these companies will just settle for money.